Roxanne Abrams is here with us this morning. She's the founder and executive director of Operation IV. She's here to tell us about a very special event taking place right here on the CBS Radford lot this evening. Good morning, Roxanne. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me. So, you know, Operation IV, it, I was looking at it. I had to double check. It's not Operation 4. Correct. It's <laughs> Operation IV, and it means an intravenous of help for an Iraq and Afghanistan veteran. Right, and so this event tonight is going to be jam-packed, full of comedy, but this is a very serious um, topic and near and dear to your heart. Let's talk about that. Yeah, yes, it is. I'm actually a Gold Star mother, and I lost my son to PTSD suicide after his return home from his third tour in Iraq. Mm -hmm. And so after your loss, and I'm so sorry, my condolences, you decided that you wanted to help folks uh, go through or not, or not actually go through what you actually went through. Yes, the best way for me to honor my son and is to see him to, on the screen right now is to help his brothers and sisters. Okay. And I don't want any other mothers or families to deal with the loss that I've dealt with, and it's just not necessary. Your son actually went on three tours of duty. Yes, he he did. He came back in 2009, and after his return home, he began to have problems with PTSD, and he took his life one night during a PTSD flashback. So what are the type of, uh, with your organization, what do you hope mm -hmm. to achieve? I know you guys are also trying to talk to lawmakers and, and you know, and bring some change to all of this. We, we are. Operation IV offers a very one-of-a-kind, unique treatment program for our PTSD combat veterans. And this is a great opportunity for people in Los Angeles to come out and learn about the actual effects of PTSD and to also find out about our treatment program that we're offering. Okay. No other organization is providing what we offer. Right, I read that, that you're a one-of-a-kind organization. We don't see any of any other organizations like this throughout our country, so mm -hmm. talk about the, that. Our Veteran Intervention Plan VIP program is multifaceted, and it's very comprehensive, and it takes our combat vets from the beginning all the way through employment. One of the really big proponents of our, our um, I'm sorry, um, Proponents of our organization is mm -hmm. PTSD service dogs. Right. We're offering those and they help save veterans' lives. All right. And one last thing with the, the comedy event tonight, there's yes. a lot of comedians there. There's also mystery guests. Can you divulge who that is? There is. <laughs> well, no, you have to come to the event to see that. But our comedy night is headlined by well known comedian Tom Papa uh -huh. and some other comedians that are hilarious, a couple which are Iraq and Afghanistan veterans themselves. Okay, so they're able to play on some of that. Yes. With things that maybe us civilians don't know. <laughs> yes, yes, that's true. Well, we, we want to hear your PSA really quick, so we're going to go to that. Great. I served five years in the U.S. Army Infantry. I deployed to Iraq. I deployed to Iraq three times. I've deployed to Iraq, Afghanistan, and Kuwait. It tests every aspect of what you are as a person, not just as a soldier, as a person. And you get used to every day going on patrol and being like, okay, today could be my last day. Uh, days when you just completely don't want to be there and days when it's kind of the best thing ever. I can't watch the news anymore. I can't watch uh, the war movies I used to love. Sorry, I do have a friend who killed himself. 22 veterans a day commit suicide. 22. 22. There is hope. There is hope. That is a startling number, 22. Yes, it is. And with your organization, do you see, have you made some headway? We, we are. We want to bring that number down to zero. That's a great number in our mind. And with our treatment program, we are rolling it out nationwide. Mm -hmm. And one of our goals is that we would become the treatment of choice for the VA and the military for PTSD. That's great. Oh my gosh, thank you so much to, for sharing your story. The PTSD fundraiser is happening right here on the CBS Studios lot and there's still time to buy tickets. It begins at 5.30 and goes on until midnight tonight. There will be dinner, casino night, and both a live and silent auction. Come out and party for our troops. If you would like more information, just head to our website, click Scene on TV.